Hey y'all! Welcome to another exciting episode where we dive into the fascinating world of the internet and its hidden protectors. You know how we have security guards at our studios? They make sure everything is safe and secure, right? Well, websites have a guardian angel too, and it's called Cloudflare. This amazing service is like a digital fortress for the internet. Cloudflare is like a big, strong bodyguard that protects websites from bad guys. Imagine a superhero standing guard ready to fend off any cyber threats. It's like having a whole team of security experts working behind the scenes to keep things safe and running smoothly. These experts are constantly monitoring and defending against potential attacks. Just like our guards check who's coming in, Cloudflare checks every single person trying to access a website. They analyze the traffic to ensure that only legitimate users get through. They're making sure everything's cool and that nobody's trying to cause any trouble. It's a 24-7 job and they never take a break. They're the unsung heroes of the internet, making sure we can all browse and shop online without worrying about our information falling into the wrong hands. Whether you're buying a new gadget or just reading the news, Cloudflare is there, working tirelessly to keep your data safe. Think of them as the invisible shield that keeps the internet a safe place for everyone. They handle millions of requests every second, filtering out the bad and letting in the good. The team at Cloudflare is always innovating, coming up with new ways to protect us from the ever-evolving threats in the digital world. Their dedication and expertise are what make the internet a safer place for all of us. So next time you're surfing the web, remember the silent guardians like Cloudflare who are working behind the scenes. They're the reason we can enjoy a secure and seamless online experience. Let's give a big shout out to Cloudflare and all the cybersecurity experts out there. Thank you for keeping our digital world safe and sound, you four. Okay, picture this. You're super excited to visit your favorite website, but when you try to go there, bam, you're hit with a message saying you're blocked by Cloudflare. It's like hitting a red light when you're in a rush. What gives? Don't worry, it happens to the best of us. You might be wondering why this is happening to you. Sometimes Cloudflare might think you're up to no good, even if you're just an innocent user. It's not personal, it's just a precaution. It's like when our security guards get a little suspicious of someone who looks a bit shady. They got to investigate, right? They're just doing their job to keep everyone safe. Cloudflare is just being extra cautious, making sure it's really you and not some bot trying to hack the system. They have to filter out potential threats to protect the website. Sometimes, it could be due to unusual activity from your IP address, or maybe your browser settings triggered a red flag. You can try clearing your browser cache, checking your internet settings, or even restarting your router. These simple steps might just do the trick. If that doesn't work, you can always reach out to the website's support team. They can help you figure out why you were blocked and how to fix it better safe than sorry, right? It's all about keeping the internet a safer place for everyone. So next time you see that Cloudflare block, remember, it's just a safety measure. Once you get past it, you can go back to enjoying your favorite websites without a hitch. Happy browsing. So you might be wondering, what makes Cloudflare raise its eyebrows? What could possibly trigger their security systems to go on high alert? Well, there are a few things that can set off their alarm bells. It's not just one thing, but a combination of factors that can make Cloudflare suspicious. Sometimes, it's certain words you use. Words that might seem harmless to you, but can be red flags in the world of cybersecurity. If you're typing in something that sounds like you're trying to hack the website, Cloudflare might get a little jumpy. 
It's like a digital watchdog, always on the lookout for potential threats. It's like yelling, fire, in a crowded theatre, not cool, man. Just as that would cause panic and chaos, certain actions online can trigger security protocols. Other times, it could be something technical, like using SQL commands. These are special codes that can manipulate databases and, if used maliciously, they can cause serious damage. Those are special codes that hackers use to mess with websites, so Cloudflare keeps a close eye out for them. It's all about keeping the internet a safer place for everyone. So next time you see a warning or get blocked, remember, it's just Cloudflare doing its job. They're there to protect you and the websites you visit. Stay safe online and always be mindful of what you type and where you click. The digital world is vast, but with the right precautions, we can all navigate it safely. All right, so you're blocked by Cloudflare. Don't panic. There are a few things you can try to get back on track. First things first, try clearing your browser's cache and cookies. Sometimes, Old data can cause conflicts and make Cloudflare think you're someone you're not. If that doesn't work, try accessing the website using a different browser or device. It's like trying a different door to get into the building. Sometimes one entrance might be blocked, but another one works just fine. Section 5. Talk to the boss. Contacting the website. Still can't get in? No worries, there's another solution. Remember how I said Cloudflare is like a bodyguard? Well, sometimes you need to talk to the boss directly. If you're sure you're not the problem, reach out to the website you're trying to visit. They might be able to give you a hand getting unblocked. It's like calling the owner of the house if the security guard won't let you in. They have the final say. Section 6. Sharing is caring. Your Ray ID is key. Now, when you contact the website owner, there's a special code that'll help them out big time. Your Cloudflare Ray ID. It's like a secret password that tells them exactly what happened. You can usually find this Ray ID on the error page Cloudflare shows you. Make sure to include it in your message to the website owner. This helps them track down the issue and get you back to browsing in no time. Section 7. Cloudflare's Balancing Act. Security versus access. You see, Cloudflare's job isn't always easy. They have to find a balance between keeping everyone safe and making sure real people can still access the websites they love. It's like walking a tightrope. They're constantly adjusting and improving their techniques to keep the bad guys out while letting the good guys in. Sometimes, mistakes happen and innocent users get caught in the crossfire. But hey, that's why it's important to know how to troubleshoot these issues. Section 8. Staying safe online. Everyone's responsibility. Now, even though Cloudflare is working hard to protect us, it's important to remember that online security is everyone's responsibility. Just like you wouldn't walk around with your wallet hanging out of your pocket, you've got to be smart online too. Use strong passwords, be careful about the links you click, and always double check before entering your personal information. Every little bit helps. Section 9. A safer internet for all. It's a team effort. At the end of the day, we all want the same thing. A safe and enjoyable internet for everyone. Cloudflare is playing a huge role in making that happen, but they can't do it alone. We all need to do our part. By understanding how Cloudflare works and taking steps to protect ourselves, we can create a more secure online world for everyone. And that's something worth